Acer with Torch. New and improved. But this time he's gonna make sure you stay dead. Welcome to Collection TV. I'm your host Henry Motorcoop here, and today we're going to be taking a look at Acer with Torch. But before you click off this video, since it's an old diecast, I thought I might mention that this is actually a new Acer that was sadly cancelled in the year of 2016. It may actually be a prototype, but we'll talk about that later. So anyways, this Acer is actually a new Acer that was never actually released but it was supposedly to be released in 2016 because I believe it appeared on like walmart.com. However, it never got an actual release, but I'm starting to think that it may actually be a prototype for Jerome Ramped because we never really got any information on what series he would have been in since he wouldn't have fit in one. And as you can see here, he does have a movable visor, which the original does not. Now, I was really excited to get this die cast because you guys may recall that I actually own a 1976 AMC Pacer DL that I actually did a live stream on a while ago. I do plan on doing a review on soon though. I'm really happy to see how many Acers we have finally gotten over the years. And here are some of the other Pacers and Gremlins with torches. And as you can see, all of them except for one now has a movable visor. In the movie Cars 2, Acer with Torch was seen in the Tokyo back alleys trying to kill Finn McMissile along with the help of some of the other lemons including Fred Fizbowski Pacer and an unnamed trunk of Anne Gremlin at this point. And Mater gets curious of course as you probably remember and he ends up witnessing the whole thing go down and of course Acer gets stuck to the sushi sign. This Acer is a 155 scale die cast made by Mattel with no paper stickers. I'm just really glad that he has a more accurate look and he looks more like Jerome Ramped. For those of you who made it to the end of the video, I thought I would make it up to you guys and show you guys the package from the 2012 release of him. Again, he was released in the 2012 Cars 2 die cast line and was number 34 I believe. On the back of the package, you can see some other cars released at the time, such as the Chase, Celine de Fer, Jeff Corvette, Raul Cerule, Carla Veloso, and Shu Todoroki. He was first released only at Kmart as part of the Kmart Collector Day, but I believe he was re-released later in the main line. I hope you enjoyed that look at his original package. Um, I'm actually thinking about doing some more reviews like that where I review old cars, but let me know what you guys think I should do in the comment section below. Thanks for watching our video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you get notified whenever we post a new video. Become our follower and collector on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Collection TV. See you guys next time.